I see a lot of private companies being used on a daily basis in the yeah. organisation that I work for. Completely agree, it's needed for now. But this, we're talking about extremely short term and long term. What we need is a highly functioning um, NHS that can do the job that it's designed to do. And unfortunately, under this government, we haven't been supported or allowed to do that. Hence why we're in the position that we're in now. Uh, and and there, there it is, actually. Isn't that amazing? <laughs> Two calls in Very and we've simple. got to the absolute nub of it. The absolute nub of it, which is, yes, I can be supportive of this, even if I am uh, a middle class lefty. But not if it means the structural improvements and the, the, the undoing of the damage done in particular since 2010 is never properly addressed. We are getting given targets that, are, that the government know is impossible to reach. The way that the money comes through means it's impossible to spend in the right places in the right way. We have a social system that isn't supported and so the healthcare system ends up having to support in a way that it's not designed to do. Um, so, no, I'm highly sceptical and I think... No, you mean you're, you know, you're, you're, you're not... You, you, you believe it is deliberate by the yeah, Conservative 100%, government to create 100%, opportunities for, for, for their 100%. mates like Frank Hester. No one can be that silly. Um, and it, it's so visible. Yeah. What's going well, on. I used to think no. One, I used to think we were crediting them with too much cleverness, but I think yeah. your no one can be that silly. No one can have done this by accident. Argument is possibly yeah. even stronger.